So everyone, if you want to learn more about hip anatomy, this video is going to take you through the key ligaments that we need to think about at the hip joint. So if you're ready to learn more anatomy, let's dive in. So everyone, let's dive into, first of all, the three key main ligaments of the hip joint, the ones that you will hear about time and time again. These are the iliofemoral ligament, the ischiofemoral ligament, and finally, the pubofemoral ligament. Now, these ligaments are really easy to remember because their name effectively tells us their location. The iliofemoral ligament connects the ilium to the femur, the ischiofemoral ligament connects the ischium to the femur, and finally, the pubofemoral ligament connects the pubis to the femur. Now, all three of these ligaments are considered to be bound to the hip joint capsule, making the whole area really safe and secure. And so we should consider these ligaments as extensions of the capsule rather than totally separate structures. And as you can imagine, the ligaments bound to the capsule means that there's this real connection between the acetabulum and the femur. So first of all, let's take the iliofemoral ligament. This ligament is the biggest of the three and is suggested to be one of the strongest ligaments in the human body. We can see that it presents as a Y shape because if we look at it from a bird's eye view, we can see almost the bottom of the Y before two branches going to the medial and lateral sides. So therefore, it really mimics a Y shape when we look at it. We can see that the uh, two individual strands run towards the intertrochanteric line of the femur, and therefore that's the connection that it has there. And of course, it originates from the ilium aspect of the acetabulum, just superior to the acetabulum. Now, sometimes these two strands are referred to as the lateral iliofemoral ligament and the medial iliofemoral ligament. But of course, it's totally reasonable to just call this ligament one iliofemoral ligament in practice rather than the individual strands. Like all ligaments, its key role is in stability and its main role is to prevent hyperextension of the hip joint. Now, this is really important because it's suggested that 90% of hip dislocations will occur posteriorly. So therefore, we have these ligaments situated in the anterior superior region to almost hold on to that femur if it starts going too far posteriorly. Next we have the ischiofemoral ligament which as you can imagine connects the ischium to the femur. It originates from the uh, ischial aspect here of the acetabulum moving in towards the greater trochanter. Now, what we also can see is that it's very triangular in its shape. So we've got this broad base here on the ischial side, and then the fibers almost converge like a triangle towards the greater trochanter of the femur. The role of this ligament is also in preventing hyperextension or posterior movement of the femur relative to the acetabulum. And whilst this is actually one of the weaker ligaments, in fact, it's suggested to be the weakest ligament of the three, it's reinforced by the fact that the other ligaments, including the iliofemoral ligament, the strongest one, have similar roles. So the third ligament out of the three is the pubo femoral ligament, which connects from the pubis to the femur, once again, as the name would suggest. So it originates from the superior ramus of the pubis and the obturator crest of the pubis. It then runs distally, and as you can see, it almost runs underneath the iliofemoral ligament here, where it actually blends into the medial iliofemoral ligament as well as the joint capsule of the hip underneath it. Now, the role of this ligament is to prevent excessive extension like the others, as well as excessive abduction of the hip joint to really important movements in order to restrict. And the other thing to mention is how, because of its relatively inferior location relative to the iliofemoral ligament, it also reinforces the hip capsule inferiorly as the inferior aspect is where the hip capsule 
is suggested to be weakest in all of its areas. So whilst those three ligaments are considered to be the main extracapsular ligaments of the hip joint, ligaments which are outside of the joint capsule, there are two really important intracapsular ligaments that we need to mention. The first of which is the transverse acetabular ligament, and the second is the ligamentum teres. So let's start with the transverse acetabular ligament. As we can see, it's flat in its shape and it spans the inferior aspect of the acetabulum where no bone is present. And we can see that it actually creates a little bit of a gap between itself and the acetabular notch. And the reason for this is that it allows for important blood vessels to enter up and into the hip so that those blood vessels can supply the hip joint as well as the head of femur. And then the final ligament to mention is the ligamentum teres, which is also sometimes known as the ligament of the head of femur, the round head of femur ligament, or the foveal ligament. Now the main role of this structure is actually in blood supply as it contains branches of the obturator artery in order to supply the head of femur. And this makes sense because we can see how it originates here on the acetabular fossa of the acetabulum before it runs and inserts into the head of femur directly at the fovea capitis. So directly into the head of femur for that really important blood supply. So everyone, I really hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please support us by smashing that like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel for all our best updates. Remember, we've got loads of brilliant more resources on our Instagram account, at Clinical Physio, if you want more. And of course, if you want more on hip anatomy, we've got the Hip Anatomy Bootcamp, a brilliant four-part series available on premium and annual membership with Clinical Physio, link in the description below. My name's Khalid. Thank you so much for watching. See you soon here on Clinical Physio.